Hey over there, Joe Lunchbox. And Joy Nightingale. And today, we have landed right here in Washington, D.C. Hey. We're gonna go to one of our favorite things to do in our country. So if you're ever in D.C., make sure you take advantage of it. We're gonna go to the Smithsonian Institute. Excited, Joy? I am. Right now, we're about to go to the... There's a trolley going by. We're gonna go to the, uh, yeah, the National Museum of American History. The cool thing about Smithsonian's, if you haven't been here, is they're free. They're massive museums surrounding the whole Great Lawn. Some of the greatest, weirdest collections you've ever seen. This one I like, it's all pop culture and American history, as in the name. <laughs> so you can see everything from old trains to Darth Vader, like anything. It's cool, I like it, you should go see it. So step right up, let's go for this ride. See in the picture, anything from Game Boys to hats. Actually, it's a baseball jersey. Oh, that's what they are? Oh, they Dorothy, the Ruby's red slippers. So, from Game Boys to Ruby red slippers, oh. And you want to see what I mean, we just got through Metal Texas behind us. The very first thing that you see, you walk into a museum, natural, um, American history, you're like, oh yeah, it's gonna be politicians and old technology, like typewriters. No, the first thing we come across is the Batmobile. How do you beat it? First thing in the museum, Metal Texas right there, and Batmobile. Yep, 1989 Batman. Michael Keaton. And they do a cool job lighting it, too. Yeah, with like the red and everything mm -hmm. on it. Yeah. Oh, this museum's so awesome. Are you excited, Joy? I am. I'm too. As I'm putting away my stuff, I just learned we have a rabbi lifting a Torah with the image of here stand. But why are they doing Spock with longer prosper hands? It is the look. Don't shake your head no on me, Joy. <laughs> His hands, like, look. Live long and prosper. Now look. An old stove from 1930s. It's funny as it doesn't look that much older than our stove at home. Gasoline pump from 1911. Oh, I like this one. Dental chair from 1904. Looks like the lawnmower my grandpa used to use. One from 1950. Electro oh. piano. George Cooper in New York, 1946, the bass drum. And this is Duke Ellington's electric piano. From bikes to skateboards. I wish it was a train. I was gonna start singing the Toys R Us song, but no. Ooh, I do like this old firefighter hat. Time clock from 1912. That's cool. I like this vaccine gun. And a ship model from the early 1900s. This model, how do you think they got it here? Do you think they shipped it? Going east to transportation and technology. I found my train, Joy. We passed the bikes, now we have the trains. Next week is to find video games. Then this will be the greatest toy store there is. What year is this train from? It's all a train. But me being Lunchbox, they have a special exhibit here, and I'm like, we should check it out. Food, transforming the American table from 1950 to 2000. Julia Child's Kitchen. That's really cool. We have this joy, the wall of cast iron. That's a lot of hot dogs coming at you at one time. Uh huh. The tray table. Oh, the TV dinner Swanson's. I like it. Microwave cookbook from JCPenney. That's 
cute. That doesn't look like a regular. Like. I know it doesn't. Micro go round. That's the same. Uh -huh. <gasps> Pringles. Oh, that's, that's like favorites. old. Yeah. Well, I just like the cans. The I like this old Shasta wild raspberry drink. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well. You feel McDonald's star for containers. Oh, my. <laughs> like the, the, uh, like the silicone guy? Uh-huh. <laughs> the <Pitara> sauce. <laughs> 50 states of wine. Oh. That's crazy. Wine started in California, but by now, mm -hmm. wine is produced in all 50 states. I know the exhibit is big, and your feet are tired, but you don't have to whine. That was kind of a bad one, but it's okay, we'll let it go. <laughs> I'd rather bad jokes than bad wine. I would rather bad jokes than bad wine, too. That is very good for Ooh. That's really cute. What is that? Cherry soda? Cherry soda. From ShopRite, so it's a store brand. Oh, wow. I guess it's ShopRite, yeah. Repel the 18th. Yep, getting ready for a <laughs> So we can all party. <laughs> it's all party. Stalking the Wild Asparagus. That's a good book. <laughs> See those guys? That's kind of cool. I like that name. Oh, look at the cute little pins. Boycott grapes, boycott lettuce. <laughs> I like oh this. my. Wow. The world's first frozen margarita machine. Where do I get one of those? 71. Mexican kitchen. I love an authentic Mexican cookware set. Oh. Like, really. That's really cool. <laughs> Barbecue. Some of my favorite food. I want that shirt. But more than That's that. cute. Oh, I got one of those. Those are all oh, food. Oh, no, look at the tray. In case any of you have seen, Trader Vic's Pacific Island cookbook. Where off London, so I'm drinking a pina at Trader Vic's. Oh. Doing work. This is cool, like all the different types. One big table showing the different cultures all throughout America that now have created the food of America, mm -hmm. which I really enjoy. Oh, I'm looking yeah. at these restaurants, then I'm like, hey, clam bar, New York. <laughs> that clam bar, you know what? It looks like it's on uh, Surf Avenue. That looks like Coney Island. Oh. That's the clam bar <laughs> right next to Nathan's Famous Hot Dogs on Surf Avenue in Coney Island. Oh, that's pretty cool. Look, Washington DC has a little Ethiopia. Yeah. <laughs> it's awesome looking. Yeah. Different angle now from. It's really a child. It's good. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Skippy peanut butter? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So this is like where her other one would have yeah, so, been. So this is where if we were in the kitchen, this was a walnut window. This is where Julia Child would have these pans hanging. Oh, that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Mm -hmm. I would love a kitchen like that. <laughs> that wall over there that we couldn't see? It got pushed over. Wow. That's insane. <gasps> that is awesome. I hate to cook pop. Oh, look at that. Hi. Mm -hmm. oh. And then emerald stuff. I mean, this only goes 2001. We do have some chefs more recent, like Bobby Flay and Rick Bayless, two of my mom's favorites. Oh, Bobby Flay, 2004. Huh? Oh, I didn't see him Oh, so these chefs appeared on television by 2001. Joy, what's bugging me out, Joy? 
when I was a little kid, I used to watch this guy. And I don't know who he was or who his name is. And I hate it. So I still don't know. <laughs> I found his name. I found it. He was Paul Kodomi who I used to watch when I was a little kid. Now I can go look him up. I'm heading into the Hall of Transportation brought to you by General Motors. On the water. Do we, you want to go on America on the move or on the water? Let's go on the water. Mr. Joy, just sit right back and hear a tale. A tale of a faithful trip. It started from an island port aboard this tiny ship. Of all the tobacco carrying device they would take, the snuff boxes. I like this ivory snuff rasp. And this little snuff box man right here is pretty cool. Ooh, sweet addition. We're gonna get some sugar. Joy, do you want one lump or two? Ba -dunk, ba -dunk. I was thinking that cartoon also. Mm -hmm. I still can't fathom how in any society, any point of time, mm -hmm. someone thought it was fine to treat humans like that. And that picture of how they were shackled, sleeping. I love everyone. I feel everyone should love everyone. And I love you, Joy, even when you're out of focus because the camera's blurry. Oh, well. Okay. Life on the long voyage. That's really cool. Sea songs. Okay. I want to hear Whiskey Johnny. Oh, the life of man. Dance, Joy, dance. <laughs> I look like it's like a single song also. <laughs> I'm going to look in the gift shop to see if they have this on CD. We're going to drive home with this playing. All these old sailing ship songs. I like it. A ship surgical kit from 1870s. This, the ship's medicine chest. Can we get some of those plates? <laughs> yes, we could definitely get those oyster plates. <laughs> We're in the, the fishing area here. Do we want to go on a cruise? We're going to take the most luxurious ship ever created. Only sailed once, never sailed again. Yeah, because it's sitting at the bottom of an ocean somewhere. Yeah, it's true. Didn't a sister ship do like I don't know. This actually isn't the Titanic. It's the Mortitoneurs, first class. The Mortania. We can take this one, Joy. Okay, that's safe. I don't know how we fit on it. I don't, I don't know how to. Oh, you mean this particular? Yeah, yeah. Isn't this a cruise ship? You want to Titanic? Yes. Let's get Titanic songs now. Uh, are you ready? You excited for it? I already I like the, the sound. I wonder if they have a box set of all these. This is the sinking of the Titanic. Yeah. So is this like, how would they be able to know what they played while it was sinking? No, they wrote it in 1925. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded like this. One, 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 I like it. Now we're at Modern Ships Crossing. Firstly, all synthetic materials and plastics that we wear and use are derived from petroleum. All kinds of personal care products, too, are petroleum. But here's what I like, Joy. I want to eat some of that, some of that, some of that. Eh, I'll Did eat some I of that. that the, that's what the, uh, Pollock makes a lot of the mock crab meat, yes. Only 16 pounds of seafood per year? People need to up their seafood game. Seriously. Challenge accepted. 16 pounds of seafood? No, 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 not for one person. Not one day, one person? No. Okay, I won't do that one. Then. I love how they make this museum, like all of a sudden you're walking, then you're walking on to the ship. Find out how the engine works below. Look at that, that's crazy. What happened next? We were born. Dun, dun, dun. So I think we just finished uh, the sea. We see New York connected everything, 1920. 
and now we're near my favorite. Some trains. Choo choo. You ready? We're in Salisbury, North Carolina. And I descended the ladder and occupied an empty seat. Then I was surrounded by 12 young white men who evidently had been told of my presence by a coward they conducted. Got more big trains. Santa Cruz Railroad Company, circa 1876. Ooh, I like this refrigerator car model. Ah, uh, Capital Traction Company. We got a nice little trolley. Oh, and this guy, Joy. He's working Center Market. Buddy, I'll, I'll take a dozen on the half shell. I do. I like the cross from the country. Winter motor carriage, the booklets had the dog on it. Bud the Bulldog, his name was. <laughs> car got stuck here, looks like they're wenching it out. I do like those, those old railroad buttons. What are you doing, Joy? I've come from far away just so you can play. Oh, a little teddy bear is getting shipped here. I like that. It's a window behind it. Like you're like looking like it's outside. Joy, you want to get your kicks on Route 66? That's sad, Joy. The photos they just faded it away. Yeah. Just like the olden roads. Oh, wait, it's coming back. It's coming back. Oh, look. I know so much stuff on Route 66 roadside tracks. I want to say. We've only done a little section in Illinois. Can we do Route 66 in this thing? We got our little trailer. Because it would be nice every night afterwards having a nice dinner park somewhere. We're up to the fancy car section. I like how the guy is like... He's, he wants that car. One day he's going to get it. He's looking in at it. Oh, he only got is a scooter. He wants a car. Do you want me to love attention to detail? So the car in there is a Buick. And they made in the painting the reflection of the Buick dealership, like it's showing it in it. And that's it's really cool that's when you really see stuff like this. Nice little pedal car. Chicago Transport. We get to ride the train. We want to get on. Oh, there's other people riding with us. Which is so cool. Joy, this stuff's mine. Just hold on. I like the floor. It makes it feel like you're on the floor. Yeah, the, the floor is pulsating, like, like we're actually moving. It's really cool. So that train we're on is Chicago's L. L's not the number of the train, it just means they're elevated train. I like we're waiting on the platform here. Other people going. I like near the train. Validate your transfers, folks. If you want to get your transfer, you got to remember to validate it. Different kind of payments. Look, Joy, it's a minivan like ours. But I want to tell you something that's weird, and it's bugging me out. What? So we see the cars. The cop over there directing the traffic. Because he's not colored, reminds me of when Terminator 2, the, the other Terminator started evolving into the metal form, but he was forming the cop look. That's what it reminds me of. Ooh. Next up, we have an electric car. Oh my god! Uh huh. Reinventing yeah. the car. Now this is this is crazy that this is here. Why? This is a Tucker. Yeah. There was only I, I don't know if it says it anywhere on this. Yeah. Yeah, here it is. The Tucker Corporation only built 51 of them before they stopped. Oh wow. And um, I saw one once at a car for my dad. What I like is it reminded me of a Studebaker because that center thing. Uh -huh. But if you look at the center one, that's actually a headlight. That looks awesome. And it actually would turn along with the wheel. That's weird. Yeah, it's a really rare car. I'm, I, it's cool that they have a Tucker here. Joy, when we, I was wondering what we should do at this museum next. And then I had, 
a bright idea. The lighting, a revolution. So you say you want it. Revolution. <laughs> well, I like these. Both little batteries and motors. It's funny. A lot of these are controlled by magnets. Mm -hmm. My finger, people might not know, I've showed it before, I have a magnet implanted in my finger, and right now it's vibrating like crazy. <laughs> Consequence in AC versus DC. Ah. Niagara Falls, harnessing the power. I like this little mini Pizza Hut. Pizza building designs, we have a mini mate. I see the UPS. Some Mrs. Budworth, Mickey Mouse hats. I like it. An inventor's workshop. Ralph Bear's workshop. Inventor of the first video game, very Science. Games Odyssey, Science and Media, Computer Perfection. National Inventors Hall of Fame. Imagine that, just taking things apart. Yeah, but how cool would that be? Just hanging out, tinkering all day, yeah. making all this amazing stuff. We just got into the safe. Collecting nation's history. I like this number eight, modifying this thing. Joy, look. Not that. It's the future of money. It's all plastic. Yeah. Money's an idea, not a tangible thing. <laughs> this changing exhibits for me. Magnificent obsessions while we collect. And knowing that I collect a lot of things. Of curiosities. Is that the name of the book? Uh, yeah, it looks like that. We should collect the book on collectings. <laughs> With this, the Nano Bible. Uh, wow. From Israel. They collect the chairs. That's a copy of their chairs. Musical instruments. Uh, why is it so dark in here? Because it's hard to destroys the books. Oh, I like this. Well, they also don't want to ruin it. <laughs> why do you collect? Some people collect this hobby. Others collect to remind themselves of the past. That's why I collect. Paul the Simon. Doctor. Yeah, Paul Simon. Preserve the memories. They're all that's left to me. And I like stuff. <laughs> We're talking about branding and stereotypes here. We have our cigar shop, Indians. And some logos for branding and mascots. We have Mr. Peanut, the RKO dog scrubber bubbles. Target. Campbell's Soup People. The target dog. Target dog. Morris the cat. Tony the tiger. Pillsbury Doughboy. California raisins. Oh, yeah. play. I'm just curious what this is. I like this thing. Oh, Ready kilowatt yeah. advertising puppet. I like this. This is what they used to do. So with bootlegging, because alcohol is illegal. This is actually medicinal whiskey. You need a prescription yet yeah, for this medicinal alcohol of 1929. And then we're in the spot talking about uh, prohibition and stuff. And we have Al Capone's mugshot from Alcatraz. And something I always wanted, a Thompson submachine gun. The 1920s. Oh, we have it. Yeah, it's an early Barbie, though. I can. Oh, she found something cooler. <sighs> Look at the old TV. Look at Cookie Monster sweater. I see the Cookie Monster sweater. We got Howdy Doody puppet from 1950s. So Joy, we did see it. We saw the inventor of some video, the first video game. So we did get from bikes to trains to video games. This must be the greatest toy store there is now, since Toys R Us is out of business. 
Do you want to play lawn darts? <gasps> KFC, it's finger looking good. I see. I like the room keys to the old Tower Johnson's. I like this right here. You know what that is, Joy? It's cacao bean, which is what they make chocolate from. And I like chocolate. The Fisher Price home, being foreclosed, all, all technologies. Ban the box. Magic greener tape. Going organic. And Jumanji, Coca Cola. Uh huh. I like this big McDonald's arches. Cola Turca. Challenging Coca Cola, 57% share of Turkish drink markets. They might have crashed, but they ended being famous in this museum. The crash test dummies. I love them. Mm -hmm. The head, arms, and legs of Vincent Larry. Mm. It's an awesome dollhouse. Mm -hmm. Wow. Some good words. The nation we build. Yeah, other word at the end. Together. I like the house of history. Hmm? Yeah, this house we moved here and they took apart to show how it was made. Ooh, you see more into the house, John. It goes, it's 1943. They're about to make some canning and jarring. They got the bell mason jar. So where are we going into Joy? It said many voices, one nation. Many voices, one nation, okay. Marilyn I like is for that. Crabs. I do like Marilyn is for crabs. But I like this this robotic arm for surgeries. It is a cool area again, the message across that everyone's we different we all form america mm -hmm. being a land of immigrants and a melting pot i like this those must be old tomatoes 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 for the laborers this school from the greensboro lunch counter the students that did the sit-in lunch can they will pick it in the stores to support the students in itself Looking at like stuff from political elections that they use for advertising. I like this household clock with FDR on it. I see Nashua, Concord, Portsmouth. We have a tactical version of Mount of George Washington's Mount Vernon, and then we have another model of George Washington. And here we actually have Uncle Sam's outfit. The great historical clock in America. That is really crazy. All the historic things that happen. So the clock, this is, if it was moving, a little animation. I see. You can see it right there. That's John Smith being shown. Uh, that would have been the, the Plymouth. William Penn's treaty with the Lenny Nape Indians. Do you know where the Lenny and Ape are from, Joy? Where? Delaware Valley. Uh, and then those guys up there actually go um, around. Around? And uh huh. Keep march. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, this is a cool thing. But what I wanted to show you, Joy, over here, which you might get a kick out of, ready? Is a Statue of Liberty Hanukkah menorah. Traditional Polish menorah and figures greens cast from the 19th century Statue of Liberty souvenir. Okay. It's sad to say that like our, our country is full of hate still. I wish it was gone. We have a Ku Klux Klan hood there and another an anti-Chinese cap gun where you see he's given the boot. And whenever I see any KK hood, all I have to say is KKK took my baby away. You gotta just sing the Ramones. It's a way to make it lighthearted. And you know who made these three for um, war bonds, Prince Joy? Norman Rockwell. Yep, those are four famous Norman Rockwells. I like some of this. All the advertising stuff for the presidencies. 
I never knew that too. It was macaroni and cheese for the 96 election. And they had elephants. And it was a George W. Bush um, ketchup. Donkeys. It might be my family. This is still really cool. Yankee Stadium ticket booth from around 1923. Awesome. It really is crazy all the pop culture stuff this museum has. And mm -hmm. just I'm going to name of the museum, American history. It is. So we're walking. We have a great view right here of okay. Washington Monument. You ready to see it, Joy? I can't think they made a whole room for it. I know. It. She used to be like out like in the hallway. Uh-huh. There they are, Joy. We have Dorothy slippers from the Wizard of Oz. Dorothy Ruby slippers. Nice. Miss Matchy purse. This is a Miss Match purse. Judy Garland wore several pairs during the movie. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. <laughs> Except the Smithsonian. Yeah. <laughs> and it's so funny. Everyone goes look at the slippers, but they forget about Scarecrow's hats and Glenda's the Good Witch's wand. We could walk right up to it. It's just hanging out. Yeah. And those slippers actually have their own gift shop here at the Smithsonian. Shoes to die for. Oh, that's pretty cool. Snow globe with the slippers. <laughs> We're all online to see something else that's great, right, Joy? He's get in okay. there, get in there. He's okay. He's cool. I think he's great. I'm a fan. We have an Elmo puppet. La la la, Elmo song. Sesame Street has used puppeteer and other arts to educate young children. This Elmo is actually from 1984. Oh, we have a Willie Nelson tour jack and a headband. Oh. Sting's guitar. <gasps> this is pretty cool, Joy. We have all the First Lady's inauguration. Oh no, there's just the evening gowns. Evening gowns, purses. This is what I love, Joy. I love the, when does the First Lady need new china? When there are not enough matching pieces, serve a state dinner. No. Ooh, I like this set. Mm -hmm. We got some nice oyster plates, thanks to Lucy Webb Hayes. We have more inauguration dresses. Ford Carter Reagan's. Barbara Bush. Barbara Bush. Uh, Hillary Clinton. Uh huh. Uh, Laura Bush. Laura Bush's. And Michelle Obama. Uh, stuff when the fire damaged the White House. Some cool stuff. Victor Talking Company. Uh, Victor Talking Machine Company, later known as RCA, little nipper here, with this crazy stained glass. I didn't know that factory's not that far away if it's in Camden, New Jersey. And now you can really take it in. It's really cool. Looking at the cool cameras. I like these. Geometrical forms and Arithmetical solids. Interesting stuff. Ooh, I like the train thing. I like this museum a lot more when I was a kid. It was laid out a lot different. Like there'd be a room with just typewriters, a room with just coins. And now, now the way they make it flow works very nice. I do miss the old ice cream soda fountain in the bottom where I get my malteds though. It's cool talking about puppet shows back during the Revolutionary War. This is representing Sarah Fulton, the wife of Boston tea merchant, and Thomas Hutchinson, the royal governor of Massachusetts, in a conversation over tax on teas. A little tax dermy here in the National Museum of American History, Winchester, who is the horse of General Philip Sheridan. It was preserved in New York. I like this old camera, though, personally. 
and like have it, you could sit down and take a photo of you with it. No, I wish. I like this section of the Berlin Wall with little pieces attached to it. Another section behind it. The fall of the Berlin Wall, November 9th, 1989. Behind us we have a helicopter from the Vietnam War. Steel column assembly from the 7th, 70th floor of the World Trade Center North. I remember us being New Yorkers, being in New York when that all happened. It was a scary time. Oh my god, insane. Like, people scary, couldn't get out. Scary, scary time. I like this wedding cake topper from 2008. But you know what? Mm. I wonder who baked these men's wedding cake. If only there was a chef nearby. Maybe a Swedish chef? Debuted in 1975 on the Muppet. Wow. This one's a picture of a wake. This Day of the Dead. Coffin or Box of the Dead. So there you have it, folks. The National Museum of American History here at the Smithsonian. It was cool. It I was. enjoyed it. I missed some things, but it was definitely yeah. cool. We did see a lot of pop culture stuff. There was some stuff that made me sad, some stuff that made me happy. I got to see cool trains. I love trains. <laughs> Old cameras. Video games. Video games. <laughs> yes. We're not singing the Toys R Us song yet. But yeah, so uh, National Museum of American History. Been, Been there, there, done, done that. that. Remember folks, safe travels, good eats, Thanks. and live life. I do like the, the saying that they have it. National Museum of your American History. No, the, it's they're talking about you. Your Oh, it's your story. I like it. And Elmo was part of our childhood. Not really. He came a little later. 